you will see that there are some areas around New Orleans where the walls were five feet too low. This is the levee protecting the houses, and this levee here is protecting the wetlands, and it's four feet high. This is the lower ninth. Because the levee was too low, the water came over for four and a half hours. And that created the big scour trench that weakened the levee. As soon as the trench got three foot deep, it was enough for the wall to fall over. 17th Street, the levees moved 45 feet. Catastrophic structural failure. London Avenue at Robert E. Lee, the walls had fallen over and they'd fallen into a hole. Uh, Robert E. Lee at Mirabu, there was a big blowout hole there that was over 30 feet deep. And if you looked around, there was sand. And what they didn't do was, they didn't work out what the pressure was when the water was high over here on this bit of sand, and then work out what was trying to keep it down, and we had this upward pressure and it blew out. Now what's important in this is elevation didn't really matter. What mattered was the quality of the levees that were uh, where you live. 